Welcome, today I'm going to do an overview of this Black Oak 6 inch marine light bar. This is the 60 watt flood and spot combo. In regards to the light bar itself, it comes with this Dutch connector. And if you can see, it says this is a DT 04 2P right here. DT 04 2P. This light has stainless steel bra uh, mounting brackets with plastic washers to separate the stainless steel from the bar, some stainless hardware as well. And if we go around to the back, there's some pretty nice solid cooling fins. I mean, you can't just bend those easily. They're solid. Uh, there is also a venting screw, which would allow you to uh, get out some condensation if it were to form behind your glass here. It does come with some mounting hardware as well. Moving on, it also comes with this harness. It's pretty long, so I'm gonna try to keep it nice and folded up here. Let's see, it comes, the, the, the end of this on your battery comes with these huge ring terminals. I found that this wire is one by 1.5 millimeter squared. Next is the fuse holder. That comes with a 5 amp fuse. Which I'll get into shortly. Moving down, there is a relay. And I wish I knew that brand, 40 amp relay. Not a Black Oak brand, uh, but who knows? I have no reason to doubt it at this time. Then moving farther down yet, there is a switch. And then at the end where you would connect to the light bar, there is the Dutch connector for the other side. And this says right here, DT06 2S. See if I can get that to show up. I will now plug my light into the wiring harness and I will turn it on. No surprises there. I'll do a brightness test outside shortly. And it's worth mentioning that this switch does light up. Anyway, uh, now let's see how much current this draws. I will now turn on my light, take this clamp meter, set it to amps, then I'm going to select DC, now I have to zero it out by holding select. Now I will put my clamp around this positive power wire here. And as you can see, this is only drawing about 2.67 amps, two and two thirds roughly.
Well, thank you very much for watching, and as always, please hit like and subscribe so I can get helped out by the YouTube algorithm. Thank you.